Welcome back. If you're first time joining me, my name is Hun. Uh, my channel is about making coffee using uh, Bread Burst Express and also with uh, also I do home roasting and some coffee recipes as well. So today I'm going to dial it in. Uh, so uh, I bought, uh, yesterday I was walking around local market. I found uh, this bag of Lavazza Rosa, uh, which is medium roast for 20, what, about $21. But I found on Amazon for 19 bucks for over two pounds of roasted beans. I don't usually buy uh, store-bought beans. I, I do uh, home roasting, but for a deal like this, can pass it on. So today I'm going to show you how to dial in on your uh, Bravo Burst Express. So, uh, stay tuned. It smells pretty good. Okay, as you can see the roast. This is definitely medium roast. I mean, it looks not bad. It's not that greasy either. So, I mean, I'm pretty happy with the overall quality here. It's not too bad. So, pretty much. Oops. I'm gonna put my container. So this is. Okay. So, sake of consistency, I'm going to measure. Uh, measure out the exact amount of beans but today I'm going to use uh, instead of a double basket I'm going to use single basket so I don't know how much beans I'm going to waste so I I rather waste on single than double so that's what we're gonna do so this is non pressurized single basket Okay, so this is, uh, I never used these beans before, so I have no idea what the ground settings, settings are going to be. So I'm going to start with the number seven, so just because. Okay. I'm going to warm up the shot glass here. exactly nine grand I mean if you're first time joining me uh, I do use uh, my homemade uh, dosing funnel I made it so uh, if you are curious about it I have a video for that as well so you might want to check it out okay. and uh, sometimes whenever you grind the beans it has a lot of clumps in it so I made myself uh, the declumping tool. So this is pretty much a wine cork with a paper clip. I stuck it in. So I go something like this, like that. Hopefully you can see it. So make sure I have no clumping. Uh, by the way, so I've been using these tools from Amazon, uh, the leveling tool. This is pretty slick. Okay. Let's level. That's it. 
So now this is ground setting number seven. And let's give it a shot here. Actually, you know what? I'm right on the express zone. It's not too bad. As you can see, I mean, I got locked out here. The question is, how it's going to taste? Is it very bright? Let's see. It's a little sour. I mean, aftertaste is a little sour there. You know what? I think I'm gonna make a little finer and see what happens. So, it's, I'm gonna set it at, this one's number seven, I'm gonna set it at number six and see. So I'm going to set it number six this time, another nine gram. This time I'm not going to use the dosing phone, I'm just going to straight from here. See what As you can see, uh, you're going to see some clumps there too, so. Okay, and the distribution tool. I'm just going to give it a little tap. So this is the number seven on setting. Okay. It's about 26 gram. So I got 9 gram in and I got 26 gram out. So it's about 1 to maybe like 3 ratio. Uh, maybe 1 to 3.5 ratio. So let's taste. It's a little better, but I don't know. I guess I'm used to my home, uh, my fresh roasted beans. So maybe this is okay. Maybe this is okay. Last two shots I made, I used a single basket. It was okay. So I wonder if it's gonna change the setting when you're using a double basket this time. So let's try with the double basket. I'm just gonna warm up the basket here.
So I'm going to use 18 gram. You know what, uh, so anyway, this is not an exact science, but you know, it's close enough. And then I'll be using my distribution tool. As you can see, perfectly level. By the way, this is a fantastic tool, by the way. And then I'm just going to temp it. OK, well, I'm going to sign it under the glass here. Let's see. I'm just going to use this glass. One up with the glass. Make sure I'm going to get the right amounts. Here we go. Okay, so right now I'm just past 12 o'clock for the zone. As you can see, it's, it's pretty good. You have very dark and rich crema. Uh, Express looks pretty good. Let's see here. So I got 18 grams in, I got 62 grams out. So let's taste. So we have three different shots. So this one is earlier uh, a single basket uh, with ground setting number seven. This is six. This is six with double basket. So let's taste. You know what? I like much better. Uh, it tastes more fuller and and the rich, more dark flavor with the chocolate. I can taste the chocolate note there, chocolate profile, what else? It's not as brighter than my other uh, beans, but I think this is great for latte, for sure. So let's go back to number uh, grand the single shots. You know what? I mean, some reason the single basket is very convenient, but comes to taste profile I get more fuller flavor from the double baskets so I mean if you have any comment on that please uh, comment below maybe you can tell the difference between if even exact setting uh, with being exact same beans and setting uh, compare single versus double so but I guess I prefer the double baskets yeah that the uh, comes to the ratio uh, like 18 grams so like comes to like ratio for how much the express or extraction I mean I've been reading about it I'm watching a lot of videos on YouTube man they got one to two ratio I got one to three and sometimes one to one ratio 
I mean, I don't think there's no, uh, I don't think there's no secret number for that. The perfect espresso, I guess, it all depends on you guys and on what taste you guys are looking for. So this is definitely not a daily thing. I mean, so if, when you have time on weekends, you know, if you want to spend, you know, maybe a couple hour, a couple hours to play with, I mean, this is a great project. But I mean, daily basis, personally, I put. Uh, double baskets, uh, 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 double wall, that's a pressurized basket. Just put some beans in, grind fast, uh, get me going in the morning. So anyway, if you like the video, please uh, like or subscribe. And next time, I'm going to make latte using Lebatza. All right, see you guys next time.